many stinks does he want killed? All of them. That's how genocide works. That's how genocide works. That's how mafia works. Hang on. What's over here? Does he provide a list? He said he wants what? ten, but I'm like... There's only so much in that cave. Then keep going back and forth. The enemies respawn when you leave, right? I guess so. Literally just go in, kill the first one, leave, go in, kill the first one again, leave, go in, kill until you do ten. <sighs> it's like whenever I'm given a bounty in, um... An orb of pure iron that crushes foes. Oh my. You have acquired thick orb. Thick orb. <laughs> Uh, so, how does this orb work? Well, you Ooh. see, it's really heavy, and you use it to bash people's heads in. No, actually, look at what happens when I, uh, use it. That, the iron orb looks actually really, really cool. Yeah. Let's see, an orb of, of pure Eat iron. Axe, bitch! Which I want to point out, yeah, no, iron, fairly heavy. If it's an orb made <laughs> out of pure fucking iron. Ah, I see. <laughs> it just becomes a fucking battle axe or a fucking war hammer <laughs> bludging people to death. As it turns out, yeah, no, that makes sense because fucking, yeah, it's made out of pure Deep. iron. I have a hammer too now. Damn, I fucking took his ass out. This is my iron orb. You've just handed me a very large war hammer. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> It's my favorite magic spell. Beat people to death. I cast fist. Yeah. I use a knock spell. I cast You're large hammer. Spell. Oh my I god, desert. It. Holy shit. I have balls of iron. I've got balls of steel. No, they're iron. <laughs> you can see it. Also, when I first heard you describe the iron orb, the first thing I thought of was the main character just grabbing the orb, grabbing someone by the neck, and bashing them in the face with the orb in hand. <laughs> DIE! <laughs> Brought to you by your orb menu. <laughs> Y'all motherfuckers got a orb menu? I don't know why, but the more I think about how funny it would be to just, like, do melee attacks with the orbs, the more <laughs> the more violent things I think of. Like, with the fire orb, you just hold it against someone's face as they slowly burn. <laughs> Video games don't cause violence, what are you talking about? Yes, hello there. <laughs> hello, motherfucker. I have iron balls, not afraid to use them, no, not at all. <laughs> I thought you were gonna fuck that up somehow, but you actually managed to. I thought I was gonna well. fuck it up too. And then I just got so carried away. Fucking, she uses the on, fucking bitch. shattered orbs and it's just like grinding someone's face with a fucking broken Where are you going, orb. boy? Where you going, little man? <laughs> He's like, ah! Ah! <laughs> what a fucking chicken oh, shit. Yeah. She's up. burning us and dinking us with hammers. <laughs> Dink. <laughs> oh. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> what was he thinking? He's like, ah, I have the high ground. I can turn around now. Oh, right. wait. So, yeah, um, I, I just learned a bit of Dark Souls lore that I didn't think I had never picked up on before. What'd you learn? Great magic barrier. Miracle of Bishop Havel the Rock. Uh, yeah, Havel's a fucking bishop. Oh. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, fuck. Yeah, the dude that wears fucking armor that's made out of stone and wields the tooth of a dragon like a giant club. Yeah, he's a bishop. <laughs> I love Havel's armor. And the, it's, and the really funny thing is, oh yeah, no, he fucking hates magic, so he devised this miracle specifically what to say- What the fuck is fuck going magic. on? So, I'm sorry, it's- the movie's loud, I'll just Everything mute. Everything is all lagging up. Hey. Oh, Peter, I think he meant the lag. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't hear the movie at all. I, I'm pretty sure it's Oh. Okay. Oh, never mind. I'll unmute then. Yeah, don't worry, man. You're good. As the cool kids say, Gucci. Yes. Yeah, I love fucking Havel's armor. I've been looking for a mod to add Havel's armor into Skyrim. But I cannot find one that is not on console, and I don't play on console. Mod has been hidden. Oh, fuck you, mod author. That? Just... Whoa! Hello, new territory. Woo! Hey. New territory. Now, this isn't new territory. This is just another way around. Yeah, I've already been here. Hold on. All the results are just like, oh, yeah, we got it for an Xbox. I don't play Xbox, you idiots. <laughs> You're still there? Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Wow. Alright, let's see what's in here. I already looked here. Apparently there's just four more of these items to kill. Hmm. Ow! How does that make you feel? I don't know. Alright, Retro Gamer Kevin. So, uh, why do the mushroom people hit, like, trucks? 
That's something I never understood. Alright, so that's eight. Apparently, logic was right. Mm-hmm. What's up? Uh, the siren quest is time. <laughs> of course I'm right. What was I right about? <laughs> <laughs> oh, this, this, yeah, the snake thing. Ow! The fucker! Definitely snake things. Oh, I have to sign in to download this. Yeah, yeah I love signing into Lopez Lab. Where's my phone? <laughs> you love signing into what? There's a fucking. There's a website for finding Skyrim mods called Lovers Lab, and it's for mods that wouldn't be allowed to be put on the Nexus for reasons. Naughty reasons? Yes. And there's this Goblin Slayer armor mod on there. It's not NSFW, it just looks really cool and it's not in the Nexus for some reason. Yeah, Lover's Lab is basically a porn mod site. Oh, oh my. Oh boy, Skyrim. Ow! Alright. Skyrim food. I think things are starting to wind down at this point. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> Forest. Alright. I can breathe easier about the safety of my soldiers mm. now to ready for the attack plan. With so few men. And one apparently capable woman. <laughs> Being against sexism. Step four, re-examine my personal biases. What the fuck? This mod's talking about presets now? Just let me download it. <laughs> I'm just gonna need your uh, credit card number. Uh, <laughs> and, uh, three Give me your social back. security, your home address, phone number. You know, just give me your wallet too while you're at it. You know, just to make sure <laughs> you're give me your house, give me your clothes, and your car. You know, just. Mm -hmm. All of it. <laughs> you can give me the PIN number to access your bank account while I'm here, just to speed up the process a little bit, you know? What's your mother's maiden name? Yeah, exactly. What was your first dog? What's the maximum amount that you can withdraw out of a out of an account without being in, having it frozen for looking suspicious? 400 bucks, roughly. Cool. Noted. 
At least that's how much you can do at an ATM. If you were in person at the bank, you could just withdraw it all immediately. But like, if you do that at like an ATM, it will only allow four hundred bucks. Yeah, that makes sense. Huh. Huh. I love some of the Dark Souls armor sets they have for Skyrim because you look at the shields and it's just like, oh yes, I too like shields that are bigger than I am. Yeah, it's part of the appeal. I also like bosses that are bigger than I am. That's like a majority of the bosses, though. That's that. That's the joke. Oh, okay. that's the joke. For a moment there, I thought you had found like some kind of super secret, like fucking dwarf boss that does a fuck ton of damage. I mean. Havel's not a dwarf, but he does do a fuck ton of damage, and he is relatively God small compared ah. to the other enemies. At least when you, at least when most people go to fight him, which is like at the start of the game, because everybody wants that ring, and also it's how people learn how to backstab ah, okay. by by practicing on this one guy over and over again. Wait, Havel's at the very beginning of the game? He's like... Yeah, no, he's in Undeadburg, which is like the first fucking area. Aside from, aside from fucking, you know, the, the Undead Asylum, he's in Undeadburg, which is like the first area after you get to Lordran. Huh. Yeah, no, he's in the basement, just fucking... Just doing what the fuck ever. Just walk up to him like, hello! <laughs> it's me! Hello, it's me. And then, you know, immediately get fucking crushed by his dragon tooth. Lord. There's a brain turner. When you take money from the bank, you gotta wonder, was the money you take in your hands from the originally yours or someone else they put in your bank? It's from somebody else. That's how banks work. <laughs> the fuck? That's for the question like I said. Oh, like, banks don't pay attention to your money as a whole. If it's in the bank, it's just all there as just like one hole. Yeah, they, they only really care if they see an addition or withdrawal of a suspicious amount. Like if someone's emptying all your account from like online ATM or something, or then they are gonna flag it and be like, "Uh, was that you?" Because someone who's trying to steal all the money from your account would do exactly that. Yeah. yeah. You know, it's kind of weird that while you're underwater, you can still use fire uh, techniques. We segue from banks to pretty water. I mean, fire. I mean, there are some fires that can't be extinguished with water. If it... Like white phosphorus. Yeah, that'll still burn water. Um, or believe it or not, like uh, electrical fires will keep. Uh, water will actually make an electrical fire worse. Because electricity and water. Yeah. Oh, Not the big fan of one another. Ah, little dragon leveled up. <laughs> little dragon. He's tiny. Yeah, he's adorable. And I like that he just flies with me. Yeah. I do so enjoy that my companion, who is supposed to remain by my side, remains by my side. Video games make people violent. Me, who's afraid to choose the mean dialogue option because he doesn't want to make the fictional character feel bad. <laughs> Whoa! Holy shit, it just pops out of the ground! Goddamn! Uh, terrified? <laughs> well, at least you're not grounded anymore. There's another one! 
eel meat. Okay then. Mmm, yummy. Gotta get that eel meat. Okay, this lip is like two fucking inches tall. How can I not run over it? I'm level fucking 29. Boy! These areas are becoming familiar. Ah, I see. I appear to have just uh, Tarzaned myself to death. Ah! You just appeared right beneath me, fucker! Yes. Twas the element of surprise. Yeah, apparently. Yeah. Yes. Ice mm. orb creates deadly icicles in the ground. Nice. I'm gonna. I make icicles that stab people in the junk. Congratulations, See? you okay, now have blue, all, blue balls. I just want to say, I just want to say, huge fan. What the hell? We have achieved blue balls. Hooray. More like no balls, because they have been punctured by icicles. Why is it not appearing in the orb menu? Scroll down. Uh, I can oh. see the little tab on the thing at the... yeah. Damn. <laughs> Did you have a brain fart? Yeah. Yeah. Well, don't That's don't okay. worry about it. It's just it is there. 